A live look toward Marin this evening where the Sausalito Art Festival has just been canceled for the second year in a row. The KPI X5's Andrea Nakano tells us this time it has nothing to do with the pandemic. Andrea? Yeah, Liz, homeless encampments is a growing issue in the Bay Area, including here in Marin County. And one art festival now has had to cancel its event. So we've spent a tremendous amount of time like dealing with COVID, but a homeless encampment moving into the park, we never saw that one coming. The chair of the Sausalito Art Festival Foundation, Luis Briones, says the festival had a license to use Marin Ship Park for the Labor Day weekend event. But with the possibility of this homeless encampment at Dunphy Park being located half a mile to Marin Ship, the festival was called off. We are uncertain as to whether we will have a festival location or not. Whether it's here in Sausalito or up in Nevada, where this community is called Camp Compassion, encampments are becoming more visible in Marin County. Dunphy Park started with one tent, and it's grown to roughly 40 during the pandemic. I became full-time when I lost my apartment at the beginning of COVID, and... Um, yeah, it sucks. It's become a well entrenched tent city from a makeshift kitchen to a mini gym on site. Arthur Bruce has a small boat anchored out on Richardson Bay, but he considers this encampment his second home. You know, I have a two year old daughter, and I, I couldn't afford rent and daycare and all the other bills at the same time. Robbie Palson is the president of the Marin County Homeless Union and he fears the population at this Dunphy Park site will grow with the eviction moratorium expected to end next month. We're being dispossessed in our community. We're, we're, our communities are being stolen from underneath us by a system that is, does, is not working out. Andrea, what are the chances the art festival will be back on next year? Yeah, organizers of the Sausalito Art Festival really do hope that that event will be back next year. But the residents at Dunphy Park are trying to organize the Rainbow Bay Art Festival to replace what will be missing this Labor Day weekend, Liz.